On Friday, the University of Delaware wrapped up its final day of sustainability events with the launch of the new Delaware Environmental Institute. An estimated 150 people packed into Mitchell Hall for the debut, including University President Patrick Harker and Governor Jack Markell. Director of the Environmental Institute and UD Professor Donald Sparks said the environmental issues facing the state are too complex to solve using traditional means. He said the institute will help UD receive funding for critical environmental projects. One of the things that the institute will do will be able to uh, perhaps be more competitive in getting large grants from federal agencies. It does bring a, a decent amount of money to the university, uh, especially as far as research programs go and things like that. Uh, it does keep us hopefully on the leading edge of green technologies. President Harker announced that the new Science and Engineering Building, expected to be built here at the corner of Lovett and Academy by 2013, would house the new institute as well as other academic programs. This space is meant to blur the lines between disciplines and, and to tear down the walls, literally and metaphorically, between instruction and research. In an attempt to engage the whole community, the university invited Delaware students K-12 through to attend the event and showcase their sustainability projects. Fifth grader Bianca Anaya said she learned a lot about the environment from the guest speakers. I thought those speakers, they might have taken a long time to get all those information and everything, and I hope I will be like them one day when I grow up. Although the children enjoyed their day, the five-hour event was a difficult task for some. I did, but the meetings were really, really long. Yet a moment on stage receiving an award for their efforts and a few words from the governor made this day a memorable one for the children. They get it not just in their head as an intellectual you know, issue, but they get it in their gut. And they recognize that, what, that their future is very much tied up in what kind of uh, earth we all leave them. Graduate student Erin McVeigh said the Institute is a powerful way to motivate students. I think when you have students that care and are involved and want something to happen, change, I think that's probably one of the best things that a university can do. This is Stephanie Krause reporting for UD News.